Now, I'm not sure if I'm the first person to come up with this, but I'm yet to see a base with this bunker. This stability bunker involves a method you should all be quite familiar with if you watch my channel, although it involves a completely different core design. Plus, it's infinitely expandable. If you guys would like to see it, I'm working on a really cool design using this bunker method. At the end of this video, I'm going to be doing another giveaway, plus revealing who won the last one, so make sure you stick around. Enough of me waffling, let me show you the bunker. This bunker works in three different stages. Stage 1 is the starter. Stage 2 is the expansion, which is the method you should all be pretty used to. And stage 3 is the bunker. We're going to start off this bunker with a simple 1x1 one one base. Place your door on the front, making sure it's made out of wood, because we will hatch it out later. And we can go ahead and place our tool cupboard in the back corner. Go ahead and place our bag in here. And we go ahead and place a box here. And then we can move on to the expansion. But before that, is your inventory severely lacking rust skins? If you use my code LEFTYP in all caps on Rust Clash, you can receive cases that can be claimed every single day. You can also claim rakeback when you use my code. Rust Clash now offer a dynamic referral code, which means you can change it every 24 hours. Rust Clash has loads of different deposit methods, including Rust, CSGO, and Dota 2 skins, and they even have a crypto option. Rust Clash has all your favorite game modes, including my favorite, the roulette wheel. Rust Clash gives away over $25,000 a week using the rain feature, which you can easily enter to through chat. So make sure you use my code LEFTYP in all capitals and get yourself some free skins. Also, make sure you gamble responsibly. Starting off the expansion, out of twig, we're going to place one triangle here. Square, and then you're going to go nine triangles off of that. Cap it off of the square, and delete all the twig coming back. Including this one. Go ahead and build back in squares. And looking all the way to the left, place this. Now you should have this little stone texture in the corner here. If you do, you get to upgrade. Go ahead and delete this twig and go nine triangles out again. Cap it off the square and delete the twig. Come back in squares. And with this one, looking all the way to the left again, place it. Now from here, we can go ahead and place one half wall. Upgrade that. And we can place a triangle floor frame on top, making sure it's connected to that half wall. It should be 28% stable. Go ahead and delete all of the twig. And we can place this half wall here. As soon as we've done that, we can come inside, delete this wood door, and place two half walls like so. Upgrade the top one, delete the bottom one. And you now have a working bunker. To place the bunker out of twig, place one here, and you can place a triangle on top like so. Upgrade this triangle, make sure that's facing the right way, and your bunker is good. When you log back on or spawn back in your bag, delete this twig and you're good to go. Simple stability bunker. I'm now going to show you the best method uh, to upgrade and to place any deployables inside here. So I've gone ahead and deleted all of the deployables just to show you again. Thank you. 
Now with these drop boxes, you want if you're planning on upgrading, you want to place uh, the roofs on top before placing any of these, or else you will not be able to place the roofs after. Just like that. Now, as we all know, it's not a LFTP base without a fridge. So in my next video, I'm going to be giving away 20 of these fridges from hell to you guys. All you need to do is leave a comment on the video saying whatever you like. And uh, I'll choose them at random with, with the app that I have. And uh, give 20 of them away to you guys. So if you want to win, make sure you leave a comment. Also, a subscribe and I'd like is extremely extremely useful as well so good luck right we're gonna pick a winner from last video's um skin giveaway so let's do it pick a winner click the button choose from all comments for a random commenter if you guys want to win the last one all you need to do is leave a comment Right, let's pick a winner. And it is XRTAN. Thank you for the comment. Thank you for the kind words. Make sure you hit me up on Discord and I'll get to you as soon as I can. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Thank you.